my name is India Chambers and um, I work for Mama's Jerk Station. We um, do Jamaican street food. It's not traditional, but um, it kind of like does a Western spin on it. So we do jerk chicken wraps, salad boxes, and veggie bean cakes. We also do the plantain um, and that kind of thing. Um, and yeah, we're going to be at Notting Carnival, Notting Hill Carnival, sorry, for the fourth year running this year. So I'm going to show you how to make a jerk chicken wrap. First of all, we warm up the wrap. We have the breast of the chicken here with the marinade on it. We cut it up into um, thin slices. We then put in lettuce cucumber and tomato. We also have a tropical mayonnaise. And then we have a hot sauce. The chicken in. And that's how you make a Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> Some people tend to think uh, when, you know, it's Notting Hill Carnival, yes, I'm gonna have some Caribbean cuisine, I'm gonna have some jerk chicken, rice and peas, but Caribbean food is much more than that. Our food has been, you know, it's a real melting pot of flavors. I specialize in Caribbean cuisine, and this year I'm going to be showcasing some real Trini food for Notting Hill Carnival. Yes, so this is where all the fun happens. I'm actually getting myself ready to cater for 850 people. For breakfast, I'm gonna be giving them some salt fish and fried bakes, which is served throughout the Caribbean. And for lunch, they're in for a Trini special treat, a lovely chicken pilau accompanied with some nice avocado. They're gonna have that energy to be jumping and enjoying themselves for Notting Hill Carnival. So here, I have the chicken. I'm gonna add some green seasoning to that. But this is the secret of our cuisine, the marinades. I have some paprika here, and I've chopped some onions and tomatoes. Some lime, Just mix that up. We normally leave this uh, to marinate for at least 24 hours. This is uh, what we call stew in the chicken, so we actually use brown sugar into that. I'm gonna add just the chicken. I'm gonna leave the, the, the tomatoes on top. So I'm gonna add the green pigeon peas, carrots, and the pumpkin. And to create that stock, some fresh coconut milk. The magic boy. This time, he's just going in there to perfume and spread that lovely aroma of what Caribbean food is about. Mr. Scotch Bonnet, time to go in. Woo now we're going to add 500 grams of uh, easy cooked rice, which has been washed. So I'm just finishing up the pilau, so I'm adding a bit of spring onion tops, mixed peppers. So you might see me mixing, but I've taken out our friend. Elsie would have spiced up that dish a little too much, you know? 